need a very tangible struggle to make this something that we can win. And you all, you all are the hope and the future of the Occupy movement. Because there's, there's no doubt, I was up there watching the speeches earlier, and every word that the speakers were saying was true. It was coming from your hearts, it was coming from your situations. And what we've done here, and what you've done here at UCLA, is you've made the issue clear. This is not about can people hang out at the park. This is about can you proceed with the public education that the state of California has guaranteed you? Or are you gonna pay so much taxes to bail out the wealthy and the banks that you're gonna be out back on the street? Hell no! We need the tents. We need the tents because we can sit here and talk till we're blue in the face. But eventually, if there's not a struggle, if there's not a fight, then the energy's gonna dissipate and people will move on and the claims, you know, people are working three jobs and trying to do a full-time load. How are we gonna sustain this if we can't really pick a fight that matters? And the thing is, is we have a fight that matters. Those tents are our hope. Those tents, those tents are the way that we're gonna get them to cut back the tuition and fees to the levels that they were before this financial crisis and get rid of the tax that they've imposed on students yeah. and all the children you This is not a fight between students and faculty. The faculty are worried that they're gonna be cut out. They're worried that this is not gonna be a world-class institution. Do we want that? No! Let the banks and the financial institutions and the wealthy that created this crisis pay for it. The state of California will not deny us. They will not deny you. I've heard a lot of talk in the bought out media that there are no specific or tangible demands of the Occupy movement. That somehow the largest gap between rich and poor in the history of the world, the largest consolidation of wealth in the hands of the fewest in the history of the world, even in the French Revolution, when Versailles took 10% of France's GDP annually, is not tangible enough for them. Well, here's something tangible enough. Our tuition prices have been skyrocketing. They have been bringing many of us closer to poverty, closer to homelessness than ever before. They've already brought hundreds of us students at UCLA to homelessness. UCLA administration does not even know the exact numbers of how many student homeless they are but they estimate it somewhere between three and four hundred. Shame! 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 A tangible thing we hope to accomplish with these tents is to get those students a home. Hopefully we can move it up to somewhere more permanent, more hospitable, but for now, we hope that this will improve their condition somewhat. If you know anyone who would like a place to stay, I have an extra tent. I'm sure there are other extra tents there available for student homeless. Please, if you have the money or an extra tent, donate, spread the word, Tell your friends, tell anyone who is having trouble affording student housing in this extortive educational environment. And they are more than welcome to join us. Thank you. I go around and look at these police today in downtown LA. They're not pigs. Even if they come here and take your tents, they're people. They're people that don't get it. They're working for the man. They're working for the man. I've done it too. But things about change. Doesn't mean they're your friends. Doesn't mean you gotta go home and just really love them to death. But when things are going down, they're people. We're all people. Yes. Woo! I don't think Mahatma Gandhi went around calling people pigs. Respect people! If I'm not mistaken. I don't think Martin Luther King went around calling people pigs. Woo! And then they beat him up. And then they killed him. It's about love. It's about change. It's about real. You're about youth. Make a difference. Don't get caught up in what it was and where you might want to go because it's pushing you along. Get caught up in what's changed. Help us. We're kind of pitiful. You guys have a chance. Make a difference. Yeah.